my mother always used to say that reputation is everything if your reputation is there you can get into any market and do whatever you want and that always stayed with me somewhere coming to today's video reputation how to build your reputation as a bioinformatics scientist in the market well it's very important for you to know this because even if you are in the bachelor's level or a master's level your reputation will compound now what is compounding you should know first so you must have if you have been to a snow um, you know snowfall and if you have if you throw a small ball of snow on this uh, floor which is full of snow on a um, you know a glacier or something so it keeps rolling down of course because of gravity but it, while it keeps rolling down it will gather more of snow around it so by the time it reaches the bottom it would have become a bigger ball of snow that's called compounding basically or snowball effect so reputation in the biotech industry bioinformatics industry is totally dependent on when did you start so you might be starting in the uh, bsc level but remember even if you start in the bsc level by the time you will touch your phd level your reputation will speak for you you don't have to speak for it okay so that's something you should remember no matter wherever you are whether you are in msc or whether you are at the um, junior scientist level or you are a senior scientist whatever you are or uh, a cso you have to keep building your reputation reputation is just like branding right but how do you build your reputation in science is something which most students most bio professionals miss and that is what we are going to cover in this video now let's start with the first aspect it all begins with training so of course you have to take the training from the right research institute okay it can be biotechnica it could be somewhere else but training is the first step once you have done the training get into project okay so you have got a project now it is very important to choose the right project okay if the project is wrong you will end up becoming a professor not a scientist okay so there there's nothing harm in becoming a professor if that is your goal good enough but project decides where you go so it's like the angle okay if your angle changes by 1 degree you will ending up in malaysia instead of going to indonesia okay so project is very important choose something which can be commercializable so commercial okay it has to be commercial okay it has to be commercial if it is if it is nothing related to commerce it is going to be shunned by the industry it is very difficult to get in so first you take the training then take up the project once you have taken up the project okay so commercial to project doesn't mean that you have to take it in a biotech company it can be in an academic setup but the topic has to be commercial now coming to biotechnica of course we always take our commercial because we get commercial projects okay now coming to the third step is make sure that you are doing a lot of literature reviews okay because to accomplish your project you have to go through hundreds of literature reviews and you have to go through all that understand what exactly uh, other researchers are doing in this field in this domain so that you become a uh, expert of this field so literature review makes you expert okay next followed by this once you have done your research of course you do the research once you've done your research followed by that you will publish your paper now this is very important which journal you publish is also very important what topic you publish is very important is it a peer reviewed scopus index journal very important also who is your co-author or who is the scientist along with whom you are going to publish is very important so now that you have the paper published here comes more keep doing more as long as you don't get a job so keep applying for the job side by side keep doing your research keep publishing more papers how do you pursue science in your lab is by pursuing more science how do you build your reputation is by doing more of research and the more research you do so it all keeps going back okay it keeps going back in circle for 3 4 times while you keep looking for a job and then the day you get the job the battle is won after that you start climbing the corporate ladder so as a student you have to start with training get into project and then do literature review do your research publish papers 
and once you have published your paper you have to also brand this so you have to go to linkedin and tell people each time you publish it is very important that you inform the world what exactly you have accomplished as a researcher keep doing that okay and the more you do the more research papers you publish your reputation compounds just like the snowball effect right and then of course gain some work experience in the bioinformatics domain once you have gained the work experience it will help you get better job high paying job and it will help you climb the work corporate ladder and then of course whenever you you find your boss happy or your project guide happy or your co-author or scientist happy senior superior happy don't forget to take a recommendation now that recommendation should be on linkedin number 1 and also take it on the letter head that is lh so on the letter head of the scientist take the this uh, word, uh, recommendation letter so that you can produce it along with your cv so this is how you if you keep doing 3 to 4 times project research paper published repeat work experience gain it and then keep applying for job your reputation comp- compounds and in the meanwhile your chances of getting a higher paying job in the bioinformatics or for that matter any industry increases now this is a very short way of telling you of course there are multiple steps which I cannot do it right now but maybe in the future videos I'll do but definitely feel free to ask me any question which you might have in the comment section and I'll definitely guide you thank you so much take care keep shining bye bye